Hi everyone, welcome to JS and RS Solution channel. Hope uh, you are doing very great at your place. This is the 8 NV tutorial in the channel. So today you will learn how to perform unsupervised image classification. So let's start. Go to start menu and click uh, NV. Go to file and then open as Landsat GeoTIFF with metadata. Here is my image file. I'm adding this and then click open. So my image file has been added here. Then zoom to extent. I will add my study area shape file or area of interest. So here is my study area shape then click open so my area of uh, interest or study area shape file also has been added here then uh, go to toolbox and write classification then you will see classification org follow uh, uh, tool appears then double click on it classification dialog appears then uh, input raster here uh, input raster is means your uh, image I mean select multi-spectral image then click OK and uh, your study area shape file or area of interest is here as max file so I'm going to add study area shape then click OK and then click next classification type no training data means unsupervised classification and use training data means supervised classification so here i am going to uh, classify as unsupervised classification technique then requested number of classes uh, put the number that uh, i mean how many classes do you want then advanced maximum iterations 10 and change thresholds 2% then click next clean up refine results you can uh, save your output uh, as uh, NV format or shapefile format so output format as NV then output file name select uh, the folder where you want to save your output file then give it a name I'm going to give it a name as output then click open and export classifications uh, vectors I mean uh, you can uh, save your output file as shapefile then choose a folder and give it a name I'm going to give the name as uh, output shuffle and then click open then click finish so our unsupervised classification uh, has been done this is the shift file of uh, this classification You can see over here our classification has done successfully. However, later I will show you how to perform post classification of the classified image and how to finalize a complete map for your research or project as well. Anyway, to get more interesting and exciting tutorials, you could consider subscribing this GIS and RS solution channel. Stay safe and take care. See you in next video. Thank you.